Hey Jack, what are we gonna draw today? A drone. It's gonna be awesome. We hope you're gonna follow along with us. You need your drawing supplies. We're gonna use markers. Some paper, something to color with. Yeah, you ready to start? Yes. Let's start with our paper horizontal or in landscape mode. And we're gonna draw the body of the drone first. Let's start by drawing a rectangle shape in the middle of our paper. Oh, we could draw, let's draw a horizontal line first for the bottom of the drone. And we'll turn it into a rectangle shape. There you go. Then we can draw the side of the drone. We're gonna come up. I'm gonna draw a little curve in it too. So it's not just a straight line. And then we can draw a the same curve on the other side, but going the other direction. And that's okay if they don't look exactly the same, but we wanna to try to get them as close as possible because the drone is symmetrical. Yeah. Which means the same on both, both sides. Yeah, if you were to split it down the middle and fold it, it'd be exactly the same. Now let's draw the top or the back of the drone. We're gonna draw a curve to match those two lines. Nice. Now we could also draw the very front. Let's draw two shorter lines coming down on each side. And then we'll connect those together. Then let's split our the body in half. We'll draw a line right through the middle. And then let's also add extra details on the side. I'm gonna draw a short diagonal line that comes out. Then let's repeat that same curve on the other side or diagonal line. Then let's draw a line that matches down here. And then I'm gonna come out with another diagonal line. And I'll repeat, repeat the same thing on the right side. Then let's draw another diagonal line that comes down I'm, and I'm tapering towards the bottom also or getting closer together. We'll do the same thing over here. And then we can connect those in at the very bottom. Let's add another line right here that lines up with the front and we're gonna add a line that comes out to the side. We could also, maybe there's a sensor or a camera over here on the left and over here on the right. Or lights. Lights, yeah, it could be lights too. Now let's draw the camera at the very bottom. The one that you use to get all of the cool footage. I'm gonna draw two lines right down the middle. Then we can draw a short line out and connect up to the top. Same thing on the right. Then let's draw a line, horizontal line crossed. That's for the top of the camera. Then we can draw a line coming down, across and back up. So we have a square rectangle shape. And then let's draw the lens in the middle. We could draw a circle. Next, let's draw the arms for our drone. We're gonna draw four diagonal lines. We'll start up here and we'll draw a diagonal line coming out to the left and also one matching coming out to the right. Then let's draw diagonal lines going down. Start here, I'm gonna draw, and this one I'm gonna draw coming out further than the top. Yeah, and then the same thing on the right side. Let's draw an oval on the end of each of these diagonal lines. This is where the propellers are. Then we can draw two lines coming down from each side of the oval. I'll repeat it on, on each arm of the drone. Then let's connect those two lines together with a curve that matches the top of the oval. Now we can make the arms to the drone uh, more 3D. Let's draw the top of each of the arms. So we'll go right next to it. We'll do the same thing over on this side. And if you want, you could get a little thicker towards the body of the drone. So we'll start close and then you can get thicker towards the body. We'll do the same thing on the right side. Now let's draw the side of each arm. We'll draw another diagonal line coming in and connecting to the body.
What's our drone missing? The propellers. Yeah, let's draw the back two first. We're, we'll draw a diagonal line that connects right through the, the oval shape. And then let's do that same diagonal line, but going the other direction on the right side. Now let's draw the diagonal line going through the front ones. And then we'll do the same thing on the right side. Now let's make the propellers thicker. We'll start here, we'll draw a diagonal line coming, or it's kind of more of a straight line going up. Then we're gonna curve or draw a diagonal line coming this way, and then we'll curve in. Let's do the same thing, but opposite on the other side. So we'll draw a diagonal line coming, a well, straight line coming down, and then we'll draw the diagonal line coming this way, and then connect in. Let's repeat the same thing, but opposite on the other side. We can draw that straight line down, match the diagonal line, and then connect in. And then the opposite on the other side, we'll draw straight up, diagonal line, and then connect in to the center. Let's repeat those same steps for the front propellers. We're gonna draw a diagonal line, match it, the diagonal line coming down, and then connect in. And then repeat the same thing, but the other direction on the other side. Let's do the same thing over here. We can draw the short diagonal line, longer one and then connect in and then the opposite side connect in jack we did it we finished drawing our drone it looks awesome but we still need to color it yeah this part will fast forward but remember to pause the video and take extra time to color your drones you ready to fast forward yeah Five. We did it. We finished drawing and coloring our drone. It looks really cool. We just used gray and also orange for a little accent on the propellers. Yeah, we also added a few extra details. Yeah, like buttons and then also part lines. You can add even more details. Yeah, or even a background. That would look really cool with clouds, maybe even a city that's really small. That would be awesome. We hope you had a lot of fun drawing your drone. And we also hope you take extra time to color your drawings and even add a background. We'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.